conceal. Let's continue, please. Make yourself comfortable and try to relax. You must take my hand and talk of Siri. Tell me where you think she might be. Who could be at her side? Mm -hmm. If Siri couldn't find me, I'm sure she would have looked for another friend. Who do you mean? Mm, Dandelion or Yennefer and Triss. Hmm. As I say, I don't have much experience. I would probably say Yennefer and Triss. Yennefer wasn't in Novigrad. Triss was. But Siri never found her. Maybe Dandelion. They liked each other a lot. <clears throat> yeah, I should just go do a knitting in the background, why not? <laughs> Here, I made you a swear. Who in the flying fuck is that? the dreams can multiply. Show the past as well as the future. The swallow. It symbolizes Siri. She contacted Dandelion. Must be a nice friend in town. Dandelion. The poet. Heard about him. Someone left him the rosemary and thyme in their will. The rosemary and thyme? Where's that? As you enter the city through the red light district, you come upon a bridge. The rosemary is just past it. Dandelion inherited a brothel? So I've heard. Thanks for your help. Good luck, Witcher. I hope you find your Siri. Okay, Witcher, Rosemary, and Dane. Yes. Yes. Broken flowers. Go rosemary and thyme. Still 
Shadow Sword. Chance to stun. And seven A. I never come back, you stinking stand. There it is. Next time I'll rip your fucking legs off and shove them up your arse till you've toes for teeth. In the nick of time, as always. Zoltan, with your boot to someone's ass, as always. Who were those men? Local color. I wasn't going more than a moment. Long enough for them to turn our home into theirs. All right, time for some spring cleaning. I've got to boot them all out. Care to join me? Of course. With pleasure. Of a taste of your. <laughs> yeah, almost like we never left Virgo. <laughs> What with the war on, no, I haven't been to in the previous two lectures. In just fine. You, though, you've weathered a bit. Something worrying you. It's about Siri. I know she came to Novigrad. Might still be here. You mean she's come back? I'll be damned. I wonder if I'd recognize her. How many years is it now? Six? Seven? But what'd she be doing here? Hiding, probably. She might be in danger. See her in your dreams? Couple times. Her and the Wild Hunt. Oh, not good. Not at all, but I know she came here and contacted Dandelion. <sighs> we have a wee problem, then. Where's Dandelion? <laughs> I'd like to know that myself. Maybe he could explain what the hell's going on. I just barely returned, as you saw. I'm expecting to come home to a hot leg of boar and some cold ale. And what do you find instead? A shite storm. Dandelion gone, the tavern chocked full of bums. I've no clue what happened. Hmm. Let's look around. Might find something that'll put us on his trail. Prime idea. I say we start on the ground floor. It's where he sat and wrote. Sat and wrote? Ha ha! I wrote from a grateful muse. Reading someone else's letters. Hmm. Ten barrels of Toussaint Dry, five cases of sodden triple mead. Hmm. Nothing here. No, 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 no! That's exactly what we're looking for. It says planner. Huh. 
dandelion in planning? Good one. Besides, anything he wrote here probably had a special system. Chaos only he could ever decipher. Actually, in the past, sometimes not even that. Give him a chance. Might not be that bad. Seems when he inherited this fine establishment, it came with some fine responsibilities. Bookkeeping among them. He also made a habit of noting down the times of his meetings, official and private. So, who'd he been seeing of late? Ah, here it is. Hmm. Seems he's only been meeting women of late, the dog. Hmm. Not a bad idea. Dandelion's pretty loose-lipped. Might have blabbed something to a lady friend that'll put us on his trail. That's what I'm counting on. Hmm. We should divide these somehow. Perhaps... Ah, fuck it. <laughs> I'll ask the lassies in my half, you interrogate the ones in yours. So, Che. Zoltan, wait. This is in verse. And you figure that's unnatural because... Wonderful. Meet me back here when you're done. Share our findings. Right, you are. Need to do a wee bit of tidying for a go. Cannot stomach the idea of coming back to this mess. And you'd be wise to read your bit before you scurry off. If you need anything, I'll be next door. Let's have a look around first. <clears throat> stash. Let's oh. oh, it's my stash. The faculty of Oxenford University is honored to grant Julian Alfred Pankratz, Viscount de Letinov, the <laughs> title of Master of the Seven Liberal Arts. Keep forgetting he's got that damn fool name. I prefer Dandelion. Here, like a rose abashed of its crimson hue, fair Rosa would sink into humour's blue. She shunned her lessons in civility to swing her dwarf with agility, a charming garden closed for villa in Guldorf. Molly, though well she knows the touch of silk and lace, she suns not straw when grip, gripped in lust's embrace. Guldorf, villa next to the morgue. <coughs> Vespula. Though timid in looks, no adventure did skip her. My heart melts when she asks, ever had a big dipper? <laughs> Far corners, laundry near the mouth of the pontar. Marbella. Though her cries are divine, when behind closed doors, standing on stage, her squawks are droned by snores. <laughs> Alia. Well, Leah, uh, Elihal, Elihal, a figure most rare, her nature dual, like deep in her eyes are made a fool. Right. Scraps of paper. That to make alcohol. 